Hey guys, I wanted to help you out. If you hadn't had a chance to set up your GaggleNet account, that, that you could do that. So first of all, you need to just open up your web browser and then type gaggle.net and then go here. You go to customer login up here on the upper right hand side. Then you need to look here. If you already have a login, you just log right in. But if you have a new user key, you can click here. And then you need to type in your user key, your username, first name, last name, and, and create a password. Click here that you accept the terms of service and then register. After you register, just go back and then you need to log in. If you don't see that at myabcusd.org sign, then you need to click here and then type in your full address and your password. And then click enter or click on login. After you get here, you can kind of see some of the things that you can do. You can check your mail by clicking on inbox and either check your mail or compose things to people by writing their address. You can write to your teacher or you can write to your friends that are in your class. Or you can also go to different things like here. We have calendars. If your teachers have set up calendars, uh, there are digital lockers, so if you're in the library working, that you can save things here and then access them. You can save them with your to your digital locker and then share them with your friends. You can also have you have a little social wall. If you have befriended me or any of your friends, and you can write things on their walls. Um, there's also a blog. You can create your own blog, or you can access my blog. Um, you can get to YouTube videos through GaggleTube and there are message words and chat thing, uh, chatting rooms that we can use later that we hope to use for a review. Um, if you don't have Microsoft Word or PowerPoint or Excel at home, you can also use Zoho Docs to create files. You can create text documents, which is just kind of like WordPad. Um, you can create Word documents or spreadsheet, which is Excel, and our presentation, which is PowerPoint. You can create those and save those really easily by just clicking on it and then making a name. Spanish project. Senora Marcroft, period six, and then just click new, and then you just click to edit it, and it opens it up, and it looks just like Word, and then you just need to save it before you get done, and anyway, that's a little bit about all the different things that you can do here, so I really want you guys to get logged in and signed up so we can start using some of these um, items in class for our projects that are coming up. All right, come see me if you have any problems or email me. Thanks, guys.